It is time for the magic from the future. <laughs> Preview time. Hey, welcome to the Wicked Gamer and Collector, and we are back with a new preview video. But before I go to start the video, I want to point out some things and just want to talk about the Pandora Box 6 and the new features. After all this time, finally they did it, they have released the Pandora Box number 6. But keep in mind, this cannot be confused with the Pandora key. So if you take a close look at the previous models, uh, as you can see already here, that the Pandora's Box number 6 is way powerful than the previous model. So if you take a close look at the support of the resolution of the games, they are using three supported resolutions. What well, is a very neat uh, extra to the Pandora Box 6 that we can finally categorizing or indexing the games. And that is very convenient because in the Pandora Box 5 you had one big list, no alphabetic order, so you needed to remember your game number. That was the only way to just quick to go through your game. But the first thing they improved is this. So, very pleased with it. If it works properly, that's something we need to find out in the review. And the Pandora Box number 6, Dream Never Ends. Really nice intro and still got an awesome catchphrase. A new one, by the way. So, if I'm looking at the main menu, they are still using that really awesome Pandora Box menu. I really love the look to it. They did a little changing the colors or the theme. They have a support of 3D games in this Pandora, also Mortal Kombat 1, 2 and 3, and even the Street Fighter X. But then is the main question, are these games the arcade versions or just the PlayStation versions? Beside the point you can index your games, you can now look at the games at an alphabetic order, so you don't need to scroll down the full list. All right, let's do a little testing of Tekken 3. And then is the main question, how quick are the loading times? And how are the games running? And it seems to be that the games are running really smooth. No lagging, great input, and a very neat feature, you can now use auto fire. The system supports a wide variety of games like old school shmups and all the games you could find on the previous model. At the back we are finding the setting button and the volume button by pressing the little micro button that comes in the setting. And in the settings we can just remap everything or and remap the buttons, check it out if everything is working properly. The setting menu is exactly the same like the previous model. The layout and also the six button support. So yeah, if you're buying the 8-button version, keep in mind you cannot use all of the 8-buttons in the Pandora software. So this concludes this little overview and preview of the Pandora Box 6. In the next video, I am going to do an extended unboxing, testing, and let's see if everything is working like it should be. I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome wicked videos, and see you next time. Bye-bye. Hi fellow YouTubers, I want to thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Yes, and uh, you also can follow me on Facebook, uh, Twitter, yeah, don't give a shit about Twitter. But Instagram, I uh, make pretty pictures and I send uh, on Instagram. So yeah, follow me.